Hi all, Craig and Latte here. It's that time again where I bring you my tips, facts, or experience that you may or may not find helpful. Archaeology is a profession that's been around for quite some time and certainly has some mixed reviews. Some love it, some hate it, but whether you enjoy it or not, you might want to start looking into what you can get out of it if you've not completed it or bothered with it at all. Archaeology, in case you're unaware, is a secondary profession, meaning it's one of the three extras that every character can have without sacrificing one of their main two professions. And it has a lot of collectibles and achievements behind it. Toys, titles, mounts, pets, and even that sandstone drake recipe for alchemy. There's a lot tied to it. Additionally, whether you know it or not, it's a huge source of in-game lore. Histories and backgrounds on civilizations, characters, special items, and even things that have yet to be fully explained or unlocked, such as the puzzle box of yogg saron which may even have some prophetic foreshadowing that could be relevant as soon as the Dragonflight expansion itself. Now, I'm bringing all of this to your attention because I have noticed something odd, and that is that archaeology has not been updated for the second expansion in a row. Shadowlands did not have a new segment for it, and Dragonflight doesn't seem to either. Despite the Explorers League and the Reliquary, the two archaeology-based factions, being major players in the new expansion story. The reason you might want to fire up your surveying equipment rather soon, and to be perfectly clear this is just my speculation, is that I suspect Blizzard is planning to do a major overhaul on the archaeology profession. There is the possibility that it could just be removed, like First Aid technically was, if you remember that, and lumped into another profession. But, whether it's being overhauled or pulled out, that means something from this profession may be lost if you wait too long. It's not uncommon for things in this game to be removed when it gets updated. I know Dragonflight just launched, and you probably don't care that much about archaeology because you're super excited for the new expansion. But I'm warning you now, because this is not a profession you could complete in just a couple days if you wanted to collect everything, and if the announcement to remove or overhaul the profession were to come soon. It would take you quite a while to get everything. I happen to be a collector and I love Warcraft lore myself, so when I'm not eyebrows deep in the new expansion, I'm going to be working on finishing archaeology to make sure I'm not going to accidentally miss out on anything, including achievements. I highly recommend you do the same. As a little idea on just what kind of collectibles you can get out of archaeology, I've done a video that covers everything I could find listed for it. This doesn't include the written lore, of course, because there's a lot of that, but at least the toys, pets, mounts, and so on that you may want to snag soon. The link for that is in the description and in the pin below. And there we have it! If you think I've missed information or you want to request I do a specific guide, let me know in the comments below. Even if I don't answer you, I just might add your idea to my list. As always, Thank you so much for watching, and remember, it's never too latte.